This is Tesla California, and this is the Live and Five Show. I'm Justin Jones. And I'm Samara. We're broadcasting live from a Live and Five Show studio here on campus. So, Samara, um, I got two teeth extracted. That's always fun. Really? Yes. Is it really? It was bleeding for three hours. Anyway, we have the scoop on the, star on the Starbucks contamination. Stick around to hear about Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, just kidding. Is your pilot and Nick's going to be high this week? Stay tuned for my weather report. We, ha we have a scoop on the no car island. We have that and a lot more on the, on the other side of the rink. Stick around. To teach me how to dance. Hey guys, get out. Why am I on the floor? I wonder what's going on out there. I think the yearbooks are out. I, I didn't get, get one! one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, we're sold out. Hey guys, can we sign your yearbooks? You guys don't have one. Buy a yearbook today and receive a free DVD to go with it. Welcome back from the break. It's time for a test off play by play. Test off invites the Test off invites the Trojans to a meal at Lazy Dog. But this this four and a half star restaurant has really good food, so so make sure to be there at next at make sure to be there next Monday at 11 a.m. to midnight. <coughs> the location is at Cerritos Mall. We have a girls basketball game. <clears throat> we had the girls' basketball game last week. Let's check. It, let's check it out with the story with our live five reporter Adrian. Hey guys, it's Adrian. We're here at the girls' basketball game. Let's check it out. What was the team's downfall of today's game? Um, letting the big girl make the layups. <laughs> well, maybe the big girl. She was kind of making like a lot of shots. So, like Maya said, not like not letting that girl like shoot, making her layups, not going after her. We were bad at defense. Um, we made a couple mistakes on uh, fouls, but I think we can control that by practicing. Um, the tall girl, we kind of failed on guarding her well. <laughs> I think the team's downfall was the fact that sometimes we let the bigger girl shoot and we didn't cut her off. Yeah. What was the highlight of today's game? Um, that we won. Like, we won. What was the highlight of today's game? Maya shooting. When Maya beat that girl a lot of times and she scored 19 <laughs> points. We won. I think the fact that almost everybody got a shot off. The girls basketball team played very well by playing great defense and making plenty of shots against the Ross basketball players. How did your team do? Um, we, did, we did really good. I think we did good. We won. I know, I said I think we did good. We did amazing. Because we won. Yeah! Uh, can you we dominated! That? Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, we made a lot of shots. We crushed them. I think our team did pretty well. It looks like the girls basketball team did pretty good. Well, this Asian from Line 5 Show Studio signing out. Game, or the basketball game with scores of 40 to 14. Time to check out your Tuesday's Action Reaction parody segment. Let's check it out with you after. We are 
back with another one. So let's just check this rap battle parody out. Let's see if we can get something done though. Dab. Hey, excuse you. You beating me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now that's a mistake. <laughs> oh, yeah. funny. Oh, yeah. When I park my car, what you do? I pull up the e-brake. Slow down. You hear that? I'm buzzing. Uh, big see? family. Mm. No cousin. You got that, bro? Oh, that's my brother. Oh, that's my big brother right here, bro. I get money. Okay. Uh, what? Balling. It's nothing. Oh! Super high fire. I don't know what the fuss about. Mm. I splashed on you every day. I bet that put your fire out. Mm. Oh, no, bro. We gonna throw over there with that. I'm not feeling it. Man, spit something, son. Huh? King of the internet. Oh. I've been there. Instagram. Ooh, since Instagram. Bathing Apes. Since Bathing Apes. True. Been true. Win streaks. What do you do with those? I in that. Finish it. He ain't gonna win, bro. Nice. 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 Oh, 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 that, that isn't good. Robin Hood, Chicken Wood, I never understood. But anyway, did you know that Soldier Boy is 5'9"? 5'9", 5'9". So I know a ton of people taller than him. My mom's taller than him, actually. I, I, I don't know what I'm doing, I'm taking too long. But, well, that is it for this week. I'll see you next time. That's it for the play play test off. We'll be right back after the break. Lamu, cars are not allowed. The, Af the African I island is living in the past. In the is living in the past. An old group of Africans have lived on the island for almost 700 years. They are, they are used to a life with no cars. On the week of February 28th to March 4th, there had been an involvement of listeria and allergen co contamination in the Starbucks food items. In the Progressive Gourmet Incorporated facility, in the gourmet, in the Progressive Gourmet. In Inc. facility, there had been a presence of listeria on a touchable surface. The contaminated breakfast sandwiches were sold in Arkansas, Oklahoma, and Texas in 250 stores. Presented by the FDA, listeria is a harmful infectious bacteria that are common in children and seniors, crippling the immune systems. Fortunately, no one was no one has been reported for listeria. Time now checking with David on the Days of Entertainment Report. Good morning, David. Good morning, uh, Justin. <clears throat> Have you ever wanted to play an action-packed role-playing game? I do. Well, we got the game for you. In the new game, Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh. 
Players can take a role of alloy, a hunter and archer as she makes her way through a post-apocalyptic territory ruled by robotic creatures. That's a new one. Uh, you can only play this game on PS4. This game comes out sometime this year. Let's see what's going on in the world of weather. Good morning, Victoria. In this mo it's time for earthquake update. This morning in Puerto Rico, there was a 2.7 earthquake, and in Ferndale, California, there was a 3.3 earthquake this morning also. Our pollen index for today is an 8.9. Moving through the week, our high will be a 9.4 this Wednesday and Friday. Here in Los Angeles, it will be very sunny. Moving up to the north, it will be partly sunny. In the Midwest, partly sunny. In the east, partly sunny. And down in the south, partly sunny also. Here in Los Angeles, our high will be 78. Moving up to the north, they'll be looking at high 50s and high 40s and low 50s in the Midwest, uh, high si low 60s in the East, high 60s, high 50s to high 60s, and down in the South, high 80s to low 90s. It's time for our five-day forecast. Today's high will be 80, 78, and our low will be 51. Maybe this week our high will be an 82 tomorrow. It's now time to check out the social pics with Thank, oh, thank you. Oh, that's Miss Sylvia, I think. She works in the office. Good morning. Because it's the morning. It's, it's a time and a place. Oh, working on the computer. Yeah, Miss Gloria. No, wait. I think the first one was Miss Gloria and the second one's Miss Sylvia. No, no. So this is Miss Gloria. See, I got that correct. No need to second guess myself. Don't forget to send in your birthday pics and your social pics. Time out checking the Daily Whirlpool with Jace. Thank you, Giassi. Today we have Dina with us. Good morning, Dina. Hi. So, how's your day going? Did you have a good breakfast? It's going well, I guess. I mean, don't really do much. So. Did you eat anything this morning? Like cereal, toast? Yeah. Cereal's great. Nutritious breakfast. Well, I love food, what can I say? I know, I do too. Would you mind reading this week's poll for us? Sure. Do you think the behavior of the presidential elections are acceptable to you? To or vote. The, uh, oh, sorry, sorry. No, 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 no. I'm going to read your guys' comments first. So I can't skip you guys. Yes, because some of the candidates are doing very bad things right now and are in a good position. And another student said, no, because one of the candidates is saying bad things and making very bad choices. Of what he is, of what he will do as the president. Wonder who that could be. To vote, visit us online, liveandfiveshow.com. We want to hear your opinions and put them on the air. Simply direct message us on Instagram at TedBoxCA. So, Dina, um, do you think the they're do you think it's acceptable what they're doing? Well, depending on which president. For me, Trump. I'm not going with that. He insulted Mexicans, and then when someone told him, he's like, "Oh, I love the Mexicans." Yo, any Mexican who votes for him, or any like Hispanic, Latino, Latina, disgrace to your own kind. Shame on you. And Donald Trump, personally, if he becomes president, I'm going back to Mexico. I don't care if I wear some Braille and a poncho selling <laughs> chocolates on the street. I can make a living out of that. I hope my family, uh, instead of being here, terrorized by Trump. I'd rather be a crazy Mexican than be, on, than be here in America on the Xbox One or PS4. I don't care. Okay, yeah. Uh... Don't wear a poncho. <laughs> Made your point Somewhere very clear out. there. <laughs> Marachi band. We're gonna get Marachi band too. Okay, bring that to school one day. Yes, I will. I'm gonna learn. That's it for the web poems. Time to check out the Daily 411. Thank you, Jace. Wow, that was a really descriptive um, rant. Anyway, what day is St. Patrick's Day in 2017? Friday, Wednesday, Thursday, or Tuesday? Take five. Patrick's Day lands on a Friday in 2017. Time now to pass the camera to Samara. Thank you. And I'm Dina. A little too much. Just a little bit. 
Anyway, one family made a surprising and incredibly lucky find. They found a paper bag filled with Ty Cobb baseball cards. They took the, car the bag of cards to a see how much it was worth, and to their surprise, it was worth up to $1 million. This family likes to remain anonymous, but they sure made a very lucky find. That wraps up our show for today. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day. Your heart will glow, and when it's time, you know you just gotta ignite.